Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas, one of my two Rogue Tech series that I'm currently running. My second one is called Cord F- Cold Forged, and you can find that on my um, YouTube channel. Please go check it out. I've also got a Battletech Flashpoint series that I'm running right now called The 900. You can also check that out as well. But today, we're going to go down and attack the planet's surface again. We are trying to flip this planet from Davian to Tortuga Dominions. So the Federated Commonwealth here, um, sorry, the Federated Suns, uh, controls 86% of this planet. Tortuga Dominion has gone up, planetary government's gone up. So we're going to go down and hit some more Federated Suns targets today. Now we've got in our lineup, let's go to the mech bay. Last episode we picked up a couple of SRM-6s. Well, it may not have been last episode, but the episode before. Oh, we got to fix this guy. Let's refit him again real quick. Um, we picked up a couple of SRM-6 triple pluses. Uh, with plus two damage and um, let's repair this real fast. With plus two damage and plus fifty percent crit damage, which we put on our assassin, so we changed the load on this guy. So we got a medium laser and uh, a pair of SRM sixes now. So it's a little bit more punchier. Still got his speed, and we got the flea up and running now, which doesn't have much. It's got two flamers, two small lasers, and a machine gun. Couldn't get much in there with the fusion core one twenty, but. It's going to do 275 kilometers an hour, so it'll be pretty pretty quick, I think. So let's get this guy fixed, and then we're going to hit the planet's surface. All right, so we're going to go down and hit a target, and I'll see you guys on the ground. Okay, guys, so today we're taking on a Davian diplomat. We're going to try and kill this guy to sway some of the power here. So he's back here like this. There's some reinforcements coming up, and then we've got a group of guys up here. The last time I played this uh, map... One of my guys got smoked right here. So we're going to try and not have that repeat. Um, so what we're going to do, this is actually the first time in this series that we were able to field four mechs at a time, which is kind of nice. And Captain Obvious pointing out that we could be ambushed, but that's okay. All right, let's see what these guys do here. We're going to be facing no, at least nine mechs, maybe ten again. So let's reserve back to turn one. All right, Prodigy, you're up. So we've got two tons of ammo on this guy now, too. So that's going to give us a good 15 turns of firing. Reporting enemy contact. The one thing I did forget to do, though, is to put camo, our uh, company camo, on the flea. But I'll do that later. All right, so we got one, two, three targets here and a fourth one behind the hill. Still no eyes on. But he's got really great evasion. I don't think I want to get too much closer. These guys aren't going to move. They're going to wait for us. So they're all four light mechs. Okay. So let's not get too close. I'm going to move up here. This flea is going to be like, I mean, we got really good movement on him. Same as the assassin, which is awesome. So we're going to be doing a lot of attacking from behind. But right now we got to keep this guy alive because he doesn't really have any armor. 20 ton mechs generally are just sitting ducks. Until this guy can get some stealth armor or some, some other stuff in there that uh, will help out. I want to find another mask system too, so I can lower the weight of that, uh, lower the weight of the engine. We want to get our Jager mech to the front here. I'm liking the Jager mech's layout now too, a little better than before. All those machine guns were okay, but we weren't really doing much damage with them. Alright, we're going to reserve, see what they do here. Yeah, they're waiting for the reinforcements, I think. That's okay. Okay, so now we have to decide, are we going to go left or right? This guy is pretty visible up here. I'm thinking that we're going to go left. Alright, so Steve... Actually, maybe Possum first. No, you know what? Steve's got the bigger loadout. Can we actually get to sight? We can. Not very good sight, though. Not much I can really do about that. Well, let's take first shot. What do we got here? Firestarter K. Large laser version, so we want to take this guy down fast. We're going to fire everything here. Ah, I missed with everything. That's pretty bad for someone just standing still. Okay, that's 15 missiles. Could be a thunderbolt, maybe? Maybe? Good to go! Uh, so now we can see this guy. Don't need to move too close. She's just gonna move up here. Don't have much evasion, but that's fine. Gonna fire everything on this guy. Alpha 
he just wants to stand there, we'll just try and get some punishment on him. Alright, Prodigy's turn. Let's get up max speed here. Do we want to see who that guy is right now? I don't... Yeah, it doesn't really matter. We're going to need to see him sooner or later, so let's get into a position here. Maybe we want to fire on him instead. What's this guy? Javelin 11B, 2 SRM 4. So this guy's still the danger. SRM's 34% chance to hit. Not bad. Firing. Okay, getting a little bit of damage off on him. Not too bad. Now Rommel here, I don't think we're going to get much evasion off of her. Yes, Commander. So we want to get to a position, I think, where we can defend ourselves. Um, I think moving and bracing might be the better idea. We're going to move up here behind the blackjack. Use the blackjack as cover. We're just going to brace here. Alright, here they go. Oh, someone's coming in for a melee attack. Hopefully he makes an attempt to come around from behind. Well, off of the side. Good enough. Ooh, nice hit. Seven chevrons of evasion. You still hit. That's awesome. Okay, here comes this guy. Okay, that... Not firing. I don't know if they have... Maybe they can't see because of the trees and the hills. Here's a flea here. Maybe we'll go flea versus flea in a second. Another melee attack, really? Well, they're going to go twice, so I don't see why they wouldn't. Plus, we all sprinted too, so we got like good evasion going. Okay, that was their main guy. So we got five. This guy's a light too. All right. So prodigy. We need to get on these guys fast here. Uh, we don't want to turn our back if we can avoid it, but I don't think we can not avoid it. Do we want to pull back. Go for all side shots, maybe? Come come around like this? I think so. I'm going to play a little reserved for this first little bit. Oh, this is kind of a back shot here, though. Really lousy chance to hit. Same with this one. We're kind of at point blank. So I think it's a little better on this guy. So we'll just fire on him. Okay, we got a tag on him. Good. We got to try and finish this guy up this turn if we can. Okay, we're going to leave Rommel for now. We're just going to reserve her. I'm going to see what they do. They got so many lights. They're all going to go before us, so we'll see what they do. I just wanted to make sure I pulled the uh, assassin back. I don't want Prodigy stuck up there. We got a Moonwalker. Here comes the SRMs. Okay, minimal damage. That's good. Warning. Minimal damage. What do we have here? A wasp. Okay. Oh, it's the uh, small laser version. So we can't let our flea get close to that because that could uh, do a lot of damage. Here comes theirs. Melee attack. So we're going to save our flea to go last just to see if there's anything that we can clean up damage wise. Now that they've moved closer, we can start putting the boots to these guys, I think. See what this guy does. See, they're not moving... What the heck kind of moonwalk was that? They're not moving very far? Oh, nice shot on the flea. Wow. Okay. So, let's reserve. Alright, Steve... Let's give this guy the what for here. Yeah, nice. We're going to multi-target. We're going to shoot this guy. And we're going to try and shoot the flea, I think. Actually, which one are we going to have a better chance with here? 20, 17. Let's go after the flea with the autocannon. Fire everything else into the back of this fire starter. Engaging Hopefully we have enough to kill. Hmm, not quite. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that one to hit. So I gotta see where our flea took the damage here. 
Oh, they're coming up. Looks like there might be a road here, up here. So, we need to move the flea. We need more evasion than what we have. Uh, that's full sprint and we can't really... Oh, we can get, to get behind the guy there. Pretty good chances to hit, so we're going to take it. So we got hit in the arm, which is, you know, kind of bad. 11 points internally. We did. I did max out the armor with the exception of the back. Or everything. Knocked down. Nice. So we should... Well... I was going to say we should be able to finish this guy up. I'm not 100% sure now because all the damage is in the back, so... Eh. Okay. What can I do for you? Possum, I want you to sprint. Let's get into the trees. What's our chance to hit here? Really bad with the AC2. So maybe we try and split these guys a bit. If we move over here... More respectable with the AC2s. In here, it's still really... Uh, it's not moving very far though, is it? It's really either one side or the other. That's. I think we're better off moving here. And then we're going to multi-target. So that wasp didn't move very far. So let's target this guy on the ground. And this guy back here. Now I know we won't be able to do a precision strike. Oh, forget it. Let's cancel that. Let's just do a precision strike on the guy on the ground. Let's go for the CT and fire everything. Hopefully we hit. Okay, so that's one down. Let's see if these guys panic a little bit. Probably not, but we'll find out. Okay, so Prodigy... We got a really good chance to melee on these guys. I kept the arm claws. So if we do this, is that a back shot? That's a back shot. We might be able to kill this guy. 84% chance. So let's do that. I want to try and get a couple of quick kills off here. At least if we hit, we, we may not kill him, but we'll do significant damage. Ugh. Well, at least he's tagged. That was kind of a waste of a turn. All right, Rommel. Uh, that guy is maneuvering around this way. Um, there's nowhere I can really go where these guys aren't going to attack. I'm thinking I have to move, though. That's the right arm damage. So if I move over here... Let's do this. It's probably not the best move... But I'm thinking that's the one we want to take right now. Let's fire everything on this guy. Okay, nice. A few hits. Structure exposed. Excellent. Gotta have at least one more of these guys down before these two guys arrive. So it looks like... They may not have a full second lance. Okay, he made a good move. Now what about this other guy, this flea here? wonder if he's going to back up. Nope. This is the wasp coming from halfway across the map board for a melee attack. For a whole 14 points damage, awesome. Damage minimal. Would have been better off running up and just firing all its mediums up, or its small lasers up point blank. What's this flea doing? What? He's just asking to die now. He's saying, please kill me. So that guy always gets stuck in the valley, so I'm not worried about him. If he somehow manages to make his way up here, sure. But usually they get stuck down in here, not figuring out how to get up the cliff. So we'll be able to take him on last. So Possum, don't think we need to move very far. We're going to move here. Since it's only two guys coming up, I'm feeling a little better about this. So we're going to multi-target. We're going to shoot this guy, and we're going to shoot this guy. AC2's on the far guy, and we're going to fire. Got it. Oh, only one hit with all that? Really? 
Ah, oh, man. I gotta connect more here. All right, Steve. Oh, they still got a guy down there. I think that is a thunder... Well, I don't know. That's something. Maybe that's a catapult. Could be a catapult down there. Slowly making his way up. So they may have another full lance. They may have some heavies down there. So let's get... Here. And we're going to shoot this guy. And... Hmm. This guy probably. So B... Not much of a chance to hit, eh? Maybe I'll save the ammo. We'll just fire everything on the back of A. Yeah, that's how you do it. Okay, he's going down. Our flea may be able to finish this up next turn. I'm going to engage the wasp again with Prodigy. So, we're going to just walk it. I don't want to run. I want to get my stability back. And we're going to unload in the back of the wasp here. If I can actually see him. There we go. 28%. What about this guy? 18. So it's still better to shoot the wasp in the back. We're going to fire with everything. Nice. Right torso gone. Is he unstable? Hmm, not quite. Okay, so this guy's almost into combat. Oh, what is it? Spider. Okay. Flamer medium laser variant. Not too bad. Okay, Rommel. Commander. Let's sprint over here. I think I want to make sure you're in the trees. We're going to get here. Roger. Now the wasp is going to get to go before us. But I think I might want to try and kill this guy. He's got nothing left in his CT, so we're going to fire on him. We're going to finish this guy up and get a kill here, hopefully. That should probably do it. There we go. Okay, cool. Two down. Now we can focus on this wasp and get rid of him. That guy's moving pretty slow. So this is the SRM4 variant. Who are you shooting on? Yeah. Good target. Okay, Wasp. Actually going to stay around, eh? Sure, man. Want to play that game? We can play that game. Yeah, see, now he's caught down there. Doesn't know what he's doing. Waiting for orders. Okay, so we're going to move back here. Uh -huh. I really wish I were in the trees, but can't really do much about it. I'm going to fire on this guy and on this guy. I want the auto cannons on B. Huh. Lower chance to hit than on A. What about this guy? Even lower. Well, I guess we fire everything on A then. Actually, you know what? Let's leave the auto cans off. And just fire. Targeting enemy I think I want to save the ammo. If that guy's a heavy mech down there, I think I want to be able to go full out on him. Didn't really need it there anyway, so we're good. I'm thinking the more and more that that's probably a thunderbolt down there. Or thunderbolt or a catapult. I think that's an LRM-20. Could be a 15. I haven't really been counting them. That's it, eh? Alright. Uh, let's get up behind this guy. Give them a nice juicy target to shoot for. We'll fire everything on this guy's backside. We're just going to leave the AC off. There's no point in firing it. Wow. Good solid misses there. Let's see what they do here. I don't know what they're doing. All right, let's sprint down. Not a good idea. We can melee this guy. So if we come in from this angle, 79% chance to hit. Let's do that. Moving out. See if we can take one of his arms. Lock 
locked on for physical attack. Nice. Torso and arm. Okay, he's tagged. Perfect. Now he's going to have to move next. Got a hand to these guys. They haven't backed off. Okay, so Rommel, you definitely need to move. Uh, that's keeping my right side to them, which I don't want to do. Let's see here. Let's do that. I copy. Only three chevrons. We're gonna need to get some stealth armor or something on this guy. Uh, let's leave off. Machine guns have a point the ability to do more damage than just the flamer. Well, I need to hit with three of them. So let's leave the machine gun off then. Nice. Two gyro crits. And he's unstable. Okay, cool. We should be able to take him down this turn. He's going for maximum evasion, obviously, by running away. And what's this guy? He's coming in for a melee. Probably a wasp. Stinger. Spider again. You really want to do that to a heavy mech? Like, with no support? I mean, I know you got balls, but that... that probably go. not a good idea. Alright, let's keep it away from that guy. We're going to pull into here. Moving out. How's this guy doing here? 32 in the CT. So we're going to multi-target again, firing on this guy and this guy. Bs are going to... Wow, is it really worth it? No, just fire on A. Let's make sure he dies. That should do it. There we go. Three down. Yeah, I think that's a catapult. Could have two LRM-15s. No matter what it is, it, hopefully it's out of missiles by the time we get there. And it'll just be plink plinking it to death. Alright, Spider. Show you why it's a bad idea to get in close. Well, still a pretty good idea. I can't, we might not even be able to hit him. Ah, a couple of points. It's tagged, though. That's worth it. Okay. Uh, let's get in. Can we melee attack this guy from behind? 84% chance. Let's do that. Nice. I know we're exposing our back to the other spider, but, uh, I'm thinking it was probably the better choice. So now he has to move. Yeah. Okay, it's kind of good that he moved there, because now we can move my dag my uh, flea over here. I keep calling these things daggers, man. Um, Waiting for orders. Okay, let's get over here. No shooting, just running. Oh, no, no, this shooting too. I'm going to fire these again. Wow. Well, I'll just fire them. Well, can't hit every time. Negative damage. Repeat, negative damage. Yeah, we saw that. Don't worry. Okay, here comes the other spider. So we're kind of lucky that those guys in the back aren't pushing up or we could be have into a lot of trouble here. So I'm thinking we're probably dealing with a medium and a heavy down there. So let's get... up into here. Yeah, I see him. Is he coming up? Oh, he might be. I think he just bounces back and forth down there. Anyway, we're going to do it this way this time for sure. Wow, really? Maybe not. Let's just save the ammo on the ACs. Fire all the mediums. Eh, one hit. Not bad. Then we're going to get Savage Steve on the other spider. Hopefully finish him off. Nice that the missiles are coming down on Savage D because uh, he's got the lowest evasion right now. I'm trying to keep it that way, only so that the, the missile boat will fire at him. But uh, 
Yeah, as long as you're shooting at him, I don't have to worry about my other guys getting killed. Firing everything on this guy. Hopefully we can burrow through. Well, not bad. Couple crits. So he's gonna need to move first. Yep. Bugging out. Waiting for orders. Let's not let him get away. So we're gonna move Prodigy up. We're gonna target that guy. Probably gonna be hard to hit, but I'm okay with that. Gonna fire everything. Not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Okay, he's tagged. Keeping that tag up on him. Panicking. Did he lose his evasion there? No, he still got it. Another mech. Moving in the light phase. He was way back there. Maybe he was the support for the leader here. I don't know. Um, I do you want to sprint? Let's get over here. Okay. Going full throttle. Make sure we stay in the woods. Gonna fire us to the side of this guy. Uh, let's leave off the two smalls and go with the machine gun this time. Get a little bit of heat back. Copy that. And do no damage. Failed to connect. Yeah, so the flea is kind of underwhelming, but the good thing about it though is that it allows us to do extra flank attacks. It's another target that people can shoot for. This guy's panicking. I don't blame him. Looks like he might be trying to come up here. I don't know if he's gonna though. I think he's kind of like intelligently stuck back there. Artificially intelligently stuck back there that is. Okay, put everything on the back of this guy. Couple hits, not bad. Okay, shooting for Steve again. Which is a good thing. I'm going to multi-target, I think, with Steve here. I'm going to move up. If I can, that is. I don't know if I can. I can't. won't be able to get both. Even if I sprint, I don't think I'll be able to shoot both. Yeah, they just don't have the uh, range. So we're just going to move up here a little bit. Got to start getting to the front lines, find out what's up here. See if we can punch through the side of this guy. Putting the AC back on. All right, not too bad. He's going to have to move now. He's fleeing the interview. Yeah, we're not coming after you. That's what you think. What's up, boss? Cannot afford to go after that guy. All an ass. So we're going to try and finish this guy up at our backside here. And we will fire everything. I don't think we'll hit the... Oh, we hit with two S three SRMs. Wow, that was good. Such a low percentage chance to hit. I'm actually shocked we hit. Let's get right up this guy's tailpipe. Copy that. Probably a bad move. Gonna do it anyway. I'm notorious for bad moves. Everything. Gonna get fired on this guy's backside and... Uh, okay. One machine gun hit. See what he does now. Ooh! No, you're getting outflanked. We're not getting outflanked. You are. It's okay. He's putting himself in a position to get killed. He's not thinking of the Jagermech standing behind him. Uh, so what do we got here? Left side. Legs. Waiting on you, Commander. Okay, awesome possum. Let's just walk up beside I'm this guy. Ready, Commander. And let's leave the ACs off, because obviously... Uh -huh. Yeah, one hit, not bad. He's unsteady, wow. About to bring the pain. Okay, we still got four guys left after this. One of them's damaged, but um, still four down there. I think we're good on ammo, so we're going to fire everything. want to make sure this guy dies. Yeah, goodbye. Don't jump into the line of fire of a heavy mech. Bad idea, especially when you got your back turned to him. Alright, so my guess is next turn. So we want to try and cool off here. we got a couple of mechs that are overheated, so we're going to bring Rommel up. 
Get some heat back. Their spider, I think this guy here is the only guy that they got as a scout. So we should be able to smoke him before their, their um, missile boat can fire again. Let's get Prodigy up here. I don't know that I want to run, per se. 34% chance with the SRMs. What if we get closer? How much closer can we get? Pretty close. 40% chance. Even better. So we're going to move forward. I'm going to give this guy a pasting. And we're going to kill him. Excellent. Enemy down. Okay, so two more reinforcements plus the man guy. Not bad at all. Yeah, he's stuck down there. I hear ya. I mean, it is kind of advantage. Max speed, no shooting. And it is, I don't know, it's not really an exploit to not kind of go up there and include him in the fight because really you want to fight as few mechs as possible at a time, obviously. But it, it sometimes feels to me like it's a bit of an exploit because he just he can't move, right? So you just kill everybody and then you go down and get him last. That's probably like an urban mech or something. Okay, we're going to walk to here, embrace. I want to make sure everyone's got all their stability and all their heat back before we go over the top here. Waiting for orders. Is that a light mech? Their main guy's a light mech? They do have a heavy. Their main guy's a light Waiting mech. For orders. On my way. Okay, we're going to turn our camera here. The main guy's a light mech. Okay, just going to move to here. Don't think they can see us. Alright, next turn. Let's see what they do. I'm going to send the scout in. We're going to reserve. Holding for the right opportunity. So the commander is a light mech. He's moving awfully slow. It makes me wonder. I wonder if it's like an urban mech, and I wonder if this is his wingman urban mech. Okay, so let's see what we're up against here. I don't think I want to send Rommel over. Uh, we're going to send Prodigy down. I want to go max speed here. But I want to be able to see both mechs. So we're going to move in here. So we do have a Catapult 1A and a Panther 9R. So the Catapult... Well, it's got LRM-15s. I think we want to try and take this PPC off since we've got a good chance to do that. And we're going to fire on this guy's side. Oh, the tag missed. Wow. Waiting on you, Commander. Okay, awesome possum. Let's clobber this panther, see if we can take him out this turn. Actually, let's multi-target. The AC-2s will probably hit the other guy better. Yeah, one of the rare instances where they will. Where they will. Okay, nice. Fusion core crit. Okay, and a good start. Let's get Steve up over here. We're just going to walk it up. Going to unload everything on this panther. Okay, not quite enough. What do we got here? He is pretty heavily damaged. So let's make the attempt. The flea will get to go again before the... Uh, Catapult moves, so I'm going to take a chance in trying to kill this guy. Fire everything. Oh, a couple of misses. Alright, let's see what they do. Alright, well at least he didn't choose to use the PPC, so that's a good thing. So, let's get Rommel back. We're going to go with her first. I think she's probably safe here. I don't think the catapult can see her especially if this guy dies this turn so let's fire everything again Copy. nope gonna have to use the blackjack on him okay prodigy let's how much damage did we do 48 melee I think we're still better using the SRM 6s we're gonna come around behind this guy since we're really close to him, the chances of the LRMs hitting are going to be really bad. we got a good chance to do some good damage here. Yeah, like that. Nice. 
hit, Commander. Sure was. Alright, Possum. Let's pull it back over here. We're going to block Set that down. flea, just in case that guy does decide to fire. And we're going to multi-target again. going to fire against the Panther and the Blackjack. Or, sorry, the uh, Catapult. AC's on the Catapult, everything else on the Panther. You get a headshot and you get a headshot. Oh, four hits. Nice. Arm gone. Good. The PPC's down. And two hits there. Nice. That was a good turn for her. I think he really can only shoot... Uh, well, I guess he can use long-range fire. Oh, no, he's not doing anything. All right, Steve, you're not even going to move. We're going to shoot this guy. We're going to shoot this guy. So, AC on B. Uh, he's too far for those. But let's put the tag on B. These only go to A. Do that. I think we'll probably be enough. Yeah. Bang, you're dead. Nice. Okay, let's see what their leader is doing here. He's still, like, backing up over there. Can't have a PPC or any long-range weapons because it doesn't seem like he's turning to fire against this here. I'm going to fire everything in this guy's backside. we still got a whole bunch more guys to go. That's a hit. That is a hit. Ready for orders. Uh, we're going to reserve because right now po Possum is in front of Rommel here. So we want to get Possum down here. Double time. And we're going to do an offensive push. Going to try for that CT back. Um, chances are we're not going to get it, but I want my heavy mech to go before him anyway. Minimize the damage against us. That and we're bringing Rommel down. Apply a little more damage before we get into him with the uh, Jaeger mech. So let's fire everything on his backside. Nice. Alright. Now Jaeger Death can come down. Want to make sure we get in his backside here. Let's kill this guy. There we go. Now we just got the leader left. Yep, he's got to come forward. So we're going to reserve. Okay, so Rommel, let's get you into the trees here. Affirmative. Just going to walk it up. Brace. Standing by. Okay, so we're not going to be able to get eyes on right away. So let's get to a position... Or we can start applying some damage. I'm just going to move forward and brace. I really hope this guy is not an urban mech with an AC-20. Find out in a second. No, looks like it was a panther. Alright, so we are going to move in. Pirate's Bane? What is that? Are you serious? Um, I don't want this guy running. We gotta get close. Got a feeling he can move pretty darn far. Uh, let's get down here as fast as we can. Alright, see what he does here. Can we get down there? We can't, I should have had a look at that first. But I think he's within range to do some pretty heavy damage to him. Is that it? Apparently. So let's reserve back so we have everybody. Now I think I want to get Steve going first. I want to try and get instability on this guy. So let's get Steve. Here. I'm gonna fire everything. Pretty good chances to hit overall. Okay, there's the left arm. Okay. 
Uh, let's get Rommel going next. Get her in close. He's gonna try and bug out right after this. You watch. Gonna fire everything on him. So what I need to do... I have to push him back a turn. Now, can I sprint around and fire over here somewhere? I can. This will give me a chance to get down behind him. Or at least down here to chase him if I have to. I'm going to do an offensive push on him. I'm going to go for the CT and fire. Okay, so at least next turn we'll go before him with the light mechs so that we can get some apply some damage to him. We can't even see him, can we? Right here. Can I walk there? Yes, but I can't shoot. Okay, so we're going to do this. And we're just going to fire. Nice! So he's not going anywhere. Let's see if he bails. Probably not. Look at he's on fire. Yeah, yeah. There's no way you're getting any parts out of these guys, that's for sure, unless they bail out. Alright, let's give it to Rommel. Uh, there's no point in moving. I'm gonna fire for the CT. Let's give her some confidence. Bang, you're dead. That's it, folks. See you at the salvage screen. Alright, so the Jager mech took a little bit of damage. Not a whole lot of damage, but a little bit. And the flea had its arm penetrated by a large laser. So that wasn't very good. Um, was hoping for some old Guardian ECM. Wait, do we have one of these already? We don't have any Guardian ECM, so we're taking this. Definitely want that. Um, double heat sinks. Ooh, we can maybe take one of those too. What else do we have? Lower arms. Nothing else really major. So maybe the double heat sink. I'm thinking the gear is better. We don't have any medium laser. We'd like to have a medium laser, but there isn't any here, unfortunately. So I think we made out pretty good. Let's take these two. Oh, we only got one Panther part. LRM-15. Yeah, well, see you on the ship. Alright, so we made about 130,000 from that, which is pretty good. The Max back in 14 days. Oh, this thing's a beast to repair all the time. Uh, so we're going to change the timing on this. Make it 10 days. Cool. So we got another, what? Maybe, if we're lucky, one mission before the end of the month. Might be able to get two if we get a... You know what? I think for the next episode, we're going to choose a nice low skull mission. And uh, maybe we get another one in before the end of the month. But we'll see. I think we're running out of missions we can pull on this planet. Uh, we may have to jump and then come back again. Let's have a look at the navigation star map. See how we did today. So, yeah. Federated Sun's down to 85 now. That's cool. Planetary government's up to 3%. But I don't really care. I'd rather have it them than uh, Federated Suns. So that's great. Okay, cool. So that's that done. Now... Um, we didn't really get that much salvage. I'm going to have a look at maybe trying to get an ECM suite into the, uh, the flea for the next time. It's going to severely hamper the weapons loadout, but, uh, we'll see what we can do. But, uh, yeah, if you liked the video, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and also check out my other series on my channels. There's another Rogue Tech series called, uh, Cold Forge, and then there's a Battletech Flashpoint series going on called, right now, called the 900. So check those out. Until next time, I'll see you all later.